So heading our way, as John has been talking, brought a lot of damages, including power outages and down or low hanging power lines also possible. Penelex says they're prepared to help as fast as they can. Today, our Philip Ward spoke with Penelex and asked them how they're preparing for this storm. Philip, how are preparations going so far? Good evening, Mike. Well, depending on how bad those power outages might be, could be a couple of days before they get the power back on, but Penlock assured me today that they're going to work as hard as they possibly can. For Penlock workers, being out in the snow and working in dangerous conditions is nothing new to them. According to Todd Myers, dangerous conditions are heading our way. Bitterly cold temperatures like we do not generally see, and we're talking about temperatures that are going to be uh, near zero or single digits and when you add that together with winds that could be as high as what we just discussed we, we could have wind chill factors minus 20 minus 30 degrees and that is what makes things very dangerous and what is it that they use most our main tool is the bucket truck that helps us access uh, you know get up the poles put the new cross arms up rehang wire everything we need to do is facilitated by these trucks, but when wind is around 40 miles an hour and above, uh, we, we can't safely go up and do that. I asked him about the workers who could miss spending time with their families this holiday weekend. Christmas is gonna be no exception this year, I'm afraid. It's, there's gonna be some line, line workers who, who miss uh, the family dinner and who miss you know, the kids opening the presents and they're out there working hard to make sure the lights get back on for everyone as quickly as possible. And those jobs that they do, those are tough jobs as well. I talked to a few of them earlier today, and I thought it was important to thank them for what they do. Now, Myers also shared some tips with us on how to prepare and be safe throughout this storm. If you see any downed or low hanging power lines, be sure to stay 30 feet away. Keep your phone charged. And if there is a power outage or you see one, make sure to report it. And you can do that by calling one lights with two S's. Again, that's one eight 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 lights with two S's, or you can text the word OUT to 54487. Again, that's the word OUT to 54487. Live on the weather deck, Philip Ward, Erie News Now.